This is Signs of the Last Days Ministry, where we connect the conditions and events happening in the world to the biblical prophecies, revealing them as signs of what the last days prophecies describe as the end of this age. Events happening now in the world are manifesting signs of the last days prophecies. They're happening, just like the Bible said, revealing to us what's really going on in the world and soon to come in the future, leading to the apocalyptic ending of mankind's rule and the establishment of the kingdom of Jesus Christ over the world. We just completed a broadcast this, pre this past Friday about unprecedented phenomena or the new normal of the last days era, where we shared how the news media is recently reporting events describing them as being unprecedented as a new normal in our world, which directly connects current events to the last day prophecies in the Bible. And now, here at the first of this week, we have another news report how that the strongest ever earthquake has hit northern Alaska. Alaska's northern region, called the North Slope, was hit Sunday by the most powerful earthquake ever recorded in that region. The earthquake had a severe magnitude of 6.4, which struck in northern Alaska, and the U.S. Geological Survey said the earthquake had a depth of about six miles. The state seismologist Mike West told the Anchorage Daily News that the earthquake was the biggest ever recorded in the North Slope by a substantial amount. He said this is a very significant event that will take us some time to understand, he told the Daily News. The previous most powerful quake in the North Slope was in 1995 at magnitude 5.2. They also said the jump from a 5.2 to Sunday 6.4 is significant because earthquakes rapidly grow in strength as magnitude rises. A magnitude 6.4 earthquake is, they, they said, 15.8 times bigger and 63.1 times stronger than a 5.2 earthquake. That's why at 6.4 this changes how we think about the ridge region, the seismologist said. He went on to say that it's safe to say this earthquake will cause a reevaluation of the seismic potential of that area. The Alaska Earthquake Center said the earthquake was felt across the state's northern region and as far south as Fairbanks. Then later that day, another magnitude 6.1 earthquake also hit on Alaska's North Slope, the U.S. Geological Survey said, and several other aftershocks were reported as well across northern Alaska. With this event of this most powerful earthquake ever recorded in that region, which experts say is a very significant event that will take time to understand and causes them to reevaluate the seismic situation, we have here another prophetic sign of the events happening that are directly connected to the last day's prophecies. For Jesus Christ taught in his prophecies in Matthew the 24th chapter, what would be the signs of the last days? And there he also said events would occur such as had not happened before. And Jesus also shared in that same discourse and in his book of Revelation called his Revelation Prophecy that earthquakes would be a prophetic sign of the last days. And the revelation prophecies of the Lord Jesus Christ foretold to us that just like this earthquake, which just happened in Alaska, that the earthquakes in the new last days normal will be earthquakes of increasing severity. For the prophecies call these coming earthquakes as great earthquakes, meaning they are severe. Revelation, the sixth chapter, verse 12, says there was a great earthquake. Revelation 11:13 also says there is coming another great earthquake. And the prophecies go on to say that earthquakes will become increasingly severe to where Revelation 16 and 18 says, and there was a great earthquake, such a mighty and great earthquake as had not occurred since men were on the earth. And we just had severe earthquakes in Bali which were close to 7.0 magnitudes, with the death toll now rising to around 400, which caused tourists there to flee and emptied throughout the resorts. And now the strongest earthquakes ever in northern Alaska. 
and data from various sources as the United States Geological Survey and International Seismological Center show that in the past decade and in the past century, there was an increase worldwide in deadly and destructive earthquakes of severe magnitude. Increasingly severe earthquakes, such as this one which just happened in Alaska, which was so severe it's causing them to rethink the dangers in the area, are a prophetic biblical sign. The prophecies do not indicate there will be more earthquakes, but that they will become more severe until they are like nothing humankind has ever seen before. More increasingly, severe earthquakes are coming as the creation of earth within itself is groaning with travail in anticipation of the new world coming in Jesus Christ, the Lord of Lords and King of Kings. As the signs of the last day's prophecies keep coming in events with increasing severity, as the world progresses more deeply into the new end time normal of the last days, for those born again through Jesus Christ spiritually into the kingdom of God, they do not cause us to be fearful, but to lift up our heads, watching and praying for Jesus, who will catch us away to a heavenly celebration of our redemption to him and our wonderful new future. But for those who are unprepared to meet God, who are not biblically born again into the kingdom of God, these signs are speaking to us and asking us if it's time for us to change how we think about Jesus Christ, to reevaluate our lives and the status of our eternal soul and the end game of our destination in the end time. The Holy Spirit of God is inviting all that will to come to Jesus Christ now and be transformed by him into a new creature in Christ so that you have the expected end that God wants for all of us. So that the last days are not someone's end time, but actually their beginning of a beautiful new future in Jesus Christ.